so much. Um, actually, one of the first tours that we ever did in our whole career was uh, was a European tour. And we were opening for uh, an artist from Canada. His name is Brian Adams. Yes. I know that seems potentially an odd pairing, uh, but at the time, we're big, we're Canadian, we're big fans of, of Brian Adams, and uh, he was playing arenas in Europe, and we were, we were just touring like this, but with way worse hair and really bad clothes, and... Um, <laughs> so, Speak for yourself, I just looked at all those photos recently, I look great. It's just, who here, who in this room is under 25 right now? Who's under 25? Okay, en enjoy your baby face, okay? Because before you know it, you go from being the person people are like, you have such a baby face, to like one day people do not say that anymore. So when you have a bad haircut, it doesn't matter, because when you're older, you look at the photo and you think, oh, my baby face. I know. See, that's the thing, is that I, who here uh, does not have a baby face? It's okay, I don't either, okay? Thank you. We're 36. Yeah, but I find a, mat a mature face very attractive now. mature face and when I look back at the pictures of us touring with Brian Adams I just see baby face like just, just bad face just bad but um anyway so one of the first places that we ever came in Europe was to Oslo and uh, and we thought it was like hev we thought this was heaven we thought this was the nicest cleanest most attractive people place we'd ever been everybody it's sort of like, um, like this. Did you yeah. say it is? It is. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> it's sort of like, I'm not completely convinced that this whole country is an artificial intelligence. Like, you've been programmed to be this attractive and friendly. Are you, sh how do I know you're not a robot? I don't even, how do you know I'm not a robot? You don't know, I don't know. I mean, I guess I could just, you know, quarter myself in front of you, but anyways, everybody was so friendly and nice to us, and there were other places on the tour where people weren't nice to us, so we've always had a really, really good feeling about coming here, specifically to Oslo, but really just in general, Norway has always been a place that we've always enjoyed coming, so thank you so much for supporting us. I know, um, I know that absolutely not one single person here was at the show with Brian Adams. But if you had been at the show, this probably would have been what you saw, was the two of us playing acoustically. So let's all just go back to 2001 for a second. Uh, it was a simpler time. Donald Trump was not the president of the United States. And I had a baby face. Tegan, Tegan had a ba uh, baby face, and both of our pants were about... It was a different time, you guys. It was a simpler, more innocent time. I listened in, yes, I'm guilty of the sushi notice. I broke down and what you met before you had a chance to hook up the bottom line, moving past it's getting noticed. I have to go, yes, I know the feeling, oh, you're leaving.
It's like we're 